Hi, my name is Dr. Megan Mathias. I'm with True North Equine, and today I'm going to talk about doing a foot soak for your horse's feet. Typically, we recommend doing this for a horse that has a foot abscess, an abscess that has already opened, or for a stone bruise. The products that you will need to do a hoof soak are Epsom salt, which you can get over the counter at a pharmacy or at most um, grocery stores, some betadine or iodine solution, a hoof pick, different sized foot soaking boots. So if, if you have a foot soaking boot, you just need to make sure that it's the appropriate size for your horse's foot. Or if you don't have a foot soaking boot, you can just use a deep flat bottom bucket, like a, like a rubber feed tub. And then access to water. Uh, we typically recommend that you use warm water if you have it available. So the first step is to clean out the horse's foot. We've already done this with our model patient. Um, so just pick out the feet and um, brush or wipe the dirt clean just so that you're not getting the water dirty when you do the foot soak. The next step is to add about a cup of Epsom salt to the bottom of your empty tub. If you don't have a measuring cup available, we usually recommend just adding two or three small handfuls The next step is to add your warm water. You just want to make sure that you have enough warm water that it's going to completely submerge um, when you put the foot into the bucket. Sometimes if the Epsom salt doesn't immediately dissolve, you can just swish around in the bottom of the bucket with your hand or with a brush um, to fully get the Epsom salt to dissolve. The final step is to add the betadine or iodine it's usually just a few tablespoons and enough to create a weak tea color. And then you just stir that up a little bit to get it a nice even color. The final step is to then put the horse's foot into the soaking tub. Some horses tolerate this better than others. So we usually recommend that you stay with the horse for the duration of the soaking to make sure that they don't step out of the tub or knock it over. Typically, we recommend soaking for 15 to 20 minutes at a time. A lot of times if you can distract them with a little bit of hay, um, that helps encourage them to stand still for longer and more patiently. Thank you. This is our tutorial for soaking a horse's foot.